Castle Sinaia. Built at the request of King Carol I of Romania, the palace represents, both through its historical and artistic value, one of the most important monuments in Romania, but also in Europe. In 1873, King Carol I bought a plot of land in Sinaia, in the same year entrusting the architect Wilhelm Doderer to draw up the plans for the new castle. The foundation of the castle was finished in the summer of 1875. It was the first foundation in the country made of concrete. The domain included the servants' quarters, the hunting pavilion, the stables, the wells with the water pipes and the park. The castle has 170 rooms, 30 bathrooms and several entrances and internal staircases and the central tower is no less than 66 meters high. Pelesh Castle was officially inaugurated as a royal residence on September 25, October 7, 1883. The castle had very modern facilities for that time. The glass ceiling of the Hall of Honor could be operated by an electric motor. Right from 1883, the castle has central heating. Since its inauguration, the castle has been equipped with hydrants that are still functional. Over time, the castle has hosted several personalities, writers, musicians, but also kings and queens. The most important visit being considered that of the old emperor of Austria-Hungary, Franz Josef, in 1896, who was very impressed of the beauty and wealth of the castle. Until 1948, the Pelesh castle remained the residence of the royal family, then it was confiscated by the communist regime, so that in 1953 it became a museum. Between 1975 and 1990, Nicolae Ceausescu ordered the domain to be closed to the public. In 1990, both Peleshul and Pelishorul were open to the public for visiting, and in 2006, the Romanian government announced the return of the castle to the former King Mihai III of Romania. <music>